Yo, what's going on everybody? This is Stridox here, bringing you a pretty serious Lords Mobile video. Now, unless you've just been living under a rock, or whatever it may be, or if you haven't even been playing Lords Mobile for a week, or whatever, they have just implemented a new update, okay? This update consists of not being able to gift a player that is higher than you. Now, whenever I say gift, I mean you have to go up into the gym area location, the top left-hand screen of your Lord's Mobile app, and purchase at least one special bundle. And that special bundle has to be a $100 purchase, or $99. It can't be $25, $25, $25, and $25. It has to be just one single $100 purchase, and you will unlock the gifting ability to gift your partners, your, your guild mates, whatever you want to call them, like relocators, speed ups, food packages, whatever it may be. If you can buy it with gems, you can gift it for the most part. Now, I'm going to be 100% honest with you guys. I'm not going to hold back one bit. Yes, I'm a YouTuber. I make videos for Lords Mobile, etc, etc. But at the same time, I care about the community. I care about you guys. And, and to be honest, this really doesn't affect me all too much. My might is roughly 120 million might, okay? So I can pretty much gift people relocators all I want. And as far as the lower might people gifting me stuff, such as relocator speed ups or food or whatever it may be, I can really care less, you know what I mean? I don't need things like that. I don't need people to gift me stuff. But at, as far as me, I like to gift other people stuff. So I just I just want to make that clear before I go any further in this video. This has nothing to do with me, man. I, I Literally, I could care less if people send me stuff, man. Everything is much appreciated, but really, I don't really need much. So let's talk about this update. This update is one of the craziest, just not very well thought out, in my opinion, update. Say you're sitting at 32 million might, and you have another player at 34 million might. You cannot send that person anything, no gifting at all. I mean, say, you, say you're getting, you're get, about to get rally attacked, or say you need to go help out your guild members, and you don't have any gems, or you don't have any guild coins to buy a relocator. Hey man, send a message to the top, hey, hey bro, can you send me a relocator, I'll pay you back, you know? Well, you know what? The only people that can send you a relocator or, or so, is somebody who is higher might than you. If you have a friend at 100 million might and you're at like 50 million might, you cannot send that guy re a relocator to come help you out. You're just going to be stuck and you're just going to get attacked. I can't tell you how many times a member from Truly Gifted has saved my life or saved another member in Truly Gifted's life from sending that person speed ups as far as like uh, wing boost to get your troops to return faster or relocators or random relocators or whatever it may be. Heck, even the T4 pipeline to help members get T4s faster. But now the lower might players cannot do this due to this brand new update of not being able to gift a higher member anything. And that's not even the worst part. The worst part about all of this Okay, like I mentioned at the beginning of the video, you need to spend $100. You cannot do 25, 25, or whatever, you know, to lead up to 100. It has to be a solid $100 purchase to unlock the gifting option, okay? Once you do that, the gifting option is now yours and you can gift whoever you want items. Well, now, man, you spent $100. And those who are like the smallest guy in the guild, you are you cannot gift nobody. So what is the point of spending $100 if you can't gift anybody anything, okay? Even if you're mid-range, if you're like, there's 10 members in your guild, right? You're 50 million might, and then you have a 60, 70, 80, 90, 100, and then you have a 40, 30, 20. The only people you're going to be able to gift anything to is the people below you. Does that make sense? I just, to me... It is mind blowing and this was not well well thought out at all. People spent real money, $100 to unlock this gifting option and now some people can't even use it. You can't implement this gifting option in the game and say spend $100 and you can unlock it and you can gift whoever you want and then months down the road just implement this new update to where you can't gift people higher than you. That almost defeats the purpose of spending $100 for the gifting option. You just you can't do that, IGG. You just can't do that. It's going to cause a big uproar like it's beginning to happen now. By the time this video is uploaded, 
Today is March 30th. By the time this video is uploaded, bro, I've done read so many messages, dude. Okay, obviously the white dot means I have not read it yet. I can scroll so far down. So far, dude. It just keeps going. Literally just keeps going of people just constantly messaging me talking about why did IGG do this? They are going to quit Lord's Mobile. They're leaving a bad review on their page, etc, etc. I mean, this is going crazy. And some of y'all might think, yo, Stridox, you're just overreacting, man. Not everybody is, is acting like this. You're right. Not everybody is acting like this. But you take a look at the Kingdom messages, you can just about go to every kingdom and there is a message on their message board talking about this brand new update with a boycott igg i don't know man like like i said to me it doesn't affect me all that much like as far as me having to send other people gifts i don't mind that there is this huge huge boycott igg huge f u igg just every kind of thing you possibly think of about IEG lords mobile going around right now guys people are boycotting like crazy not participating in kvk not spending any money in lords mobile anymore getting refunds from like three to four or five months back just it, it is really really bizarre and i hate to see lords mobile like fall or go under or whatever you want to call it guys but I'm being straight up with you guys, this update was not the best thought out update that you could have put into this game. I really want to hear everybody's opinions in the comments below. So if you have any kind of opinions, if y'all have to say anything, um, just comment down below. I'll read every comment. If I don't respond, that doesn't mean I don't read them. I always go back and read every single comment, man. So down below, comment what you think. Um, if you're for this boycott or whatever you want to call it, if you're uh, if you're against it, if you if you really don't care, I don't I don't know, man. I, don't, I want to know everyone's opinions. Comment down below and let me know. Again, if y'all want my my personal opinion on this I think in my opinion this was not the best thing that they could have done it is causing so much friction in Laura's mobile community people are arguing people are just getting all mad and wanting to quit the game sell their account and you know they mentioned something on their Facebook page talking about uh, gem sellers people who like win in the labyrinth or whatever it may be they uh, they sell their gems to people and I understand them I understand that concept of wanting to block the whole gifting options because people are uh, selling like speed ups, selling, selling whatever item you can gift, right? They're selling it to people, but there's there's some other way to to take away that ability to sell gems for real life money. You know, there's got to be some type of way. You know, implementing something like this where higher might players can only gift lower might players. Whoo, dude! Holy crap! That just IGG, bro, y'all are going to take a huge L if y'all continue up with this. Like I said, man, um, I'm not going to just go out and just rage on this on, on camera, dude. Like, whatever. It is what it is. Um, Laura's Mobile, I hope y'all get y'all stuff together. Honestly, me... Y'all can y'all can do better, man. But that's gonna do it for the video. I hope y'all enjoyed. Comment down below. Let me know what y'all think. If y'all are boycotting or whatever it may be, whatever you want to talk, just comment down below and let me know. Like the video if y'all are with this, um, and subscribe if y'all enjoyed it. If not, that's okay too. Y'all don't have to like or subscribe to my content. But I hope y'all do, and I hope y'all enjoyed the video. This is Stradox here. Hashtag PAP Stride Fan for Life, and I will see y'all later. Peace.